All right, y'all, listen. So here's the situation. The game, this game, you know, supposed to get started, I, I want to say three or two. I don't know. I, I'm, I, I promise you I'm not looking at the schedule. Here's the kicker, though. In order for this game to be legal, 40 minutes have to be played. It is currently 3.01 Eastern Standard Time. The gym will close in 30 minutes at 3.30. Great catch by Kyle Strong, by the way. So you tell me the likelihood that this game will actually count in the record. Probably not. Probably not. This game will probably not count. They're going to play it as a real game, as they should. But I don't think there will be enough time to actually count this game. It is what it is. We're still going to have fun, though. We're going to have a good time. We're still going to bring you the energy. I had to do some serious editing when I get home. Probably going to take a few days to kind of get that going. I could do it the lazy way, but I don't want to do that. All right, so let's see. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Who's going to throw? Right, he's going to throw. Eric's going to throw in that exchange. No dice. Towards the middle. God, just talking it out. He's just having just a good time. The team throw. Not successful. Oh, somebody got hit. Okay, never mind. 20 goes down that exchange. Christian. That's a headshot. Don't know who hit my man in the head, but Adam goes down that exchange. And yeah, he's going to feel that for a couple of days. Oof. All right, just waiting for it. I'm going to talk it over and fire. Gary was definitely going for a headshot. He's having a good time. Can't blame him. Uh, all right, Cole. I'll, I'll be transparent with y'all. I'm not really sure how many in. I'm not really for sure how many more NCDA games and tournaments I'm going to be doing. Definitely kind of received some news. Good news. Oh, great catch, Adam. Man. Yeah, and number 21, Scott goes down the chain. Yeah, I mean, great news. Can't really talk about it yet. As Adam with yet another catch out here just eating it up um, but like I said before um, I kind of had a feeling like my days within the NCDA was definitely coming to an end I just didn't know when it might be much much sooner rather than later much much sooner rather than later so I figure I'd use my channel to kind of just talk about it briefly Oh, that's a great catch. Yeah, zero goes down. That was a great catch, Eric. You love to see it. Yeah, Zach goes down that change. Oh, Kyle Strong reaching. Snagging the ball against Connor, number 73. But, uh, yeah. Um, yeah. I will say though, um, been involved with the league since I founded uh, VCU Dodgers Book Club back in 2011. Um, December 2011, that was a really good birthday gift. You know, birthdays in December, and uh, you know it's been a fun ride. You know, it's been a very fun ride. There's been a lot of good times, a lot of bad times. I'm not going to talk about on the air. I'll probably talk about it privately. Um, but most of all, for the most part, it's been pretty good. And I will say that the past few years has been really good as Nate goes down and out of change. You know, the past few years has been really good for me. You know, it's been therapeutic, to say the least. Um, dang. That was a good kill. Take it out number two. 
number two, Chris. And that's going to be balls over. But yeah, I mean, you know, it's, it's, it's been a good ride, you know. It's been a good ride. You know, definitely pretty much did everything that I wanted to do in the league. You know, so it's 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 been good. It's been good. Just been doing a lot of reflecting, you know, the past several months. You know, just just trying to figure out, you know, what some of the next things, you know, that you know we kind of need to do. Um. Yeah. You know, but it's been good. It's been good. Uh, the East Coast has been extremely good to me and extremely kind to me. It's been a, it's been a place where you know, anytime life gets hard or difficult or confusing, this it's always been a safe place for me to kind of just rewind, hit the reset button, try again. So, I'm very grateful for the East Coast. The past several years, you know, it's just allowed me to come, not giving me a hard time, you know, welcoming me, being kind to me, being respectful towards me, you know, really helping me out. You know, it really does go a long way. Um, man, missed catch by pull. Good kill by Garrett, though. Um, Maryland's on a 10 count now. But yeah, if I don't get a chance for whatever reason, you know, to thank the players from the East Coast, drop catch by 65. Um, that's a good kill, Nate. Um, I just want to say I appreciate y'all. You know, y'all been good to me, you know, being on the road, being away from home, being away from my wife, you know, my community. It's, it's been hard, not going to lie, it's been tough. But uh, yes, he did it. And Jasmine goes down, and oh my god! Eric with the grown man catch. Still catching all that on film, baby. You love to see it. Um, but yeah, I just, I just want to say thank you. You know, thank you for being kind to me, not being sarcastic, not saying a lot of jokes. You know, just, just treating me like a man and just being respectful. Um, life's been kind of hard the past several years. You know, we won't talk about it here. Even though it's my channel, we won't talk about it. But y'all consistency, y'all just being kind to me, it really goes a long way. And I promise not to cry on the stream. I will be crying on my way home. <laughs> I, I'm just telling you that much right now. I will be crying for about a good hour, two hours. Good kill by Garrett. Good kill by Garrett. Good team, bro. But yeah, I will be crying on the way home. Not anything bad, just, you know, just grateful, you know. So I just figure I just use this time to be transparent, you know, since it's kind of a scrimmage type of game. Dang, he couldn't catch it. Anywho, did he? Yes, he did. That's a great catch by Eric. Yes, that would count. One play left to beat. Caleb Dixon. Uh-oh. Yes, absolutely. Read it, snag it, and caught it all the way. You love to see it. Like I said, Caleb Dixon is one of the most agile players from Maryland, and by Zachary, was the best catcher from Maryland. He caught that all the way. Caught that all the way, y'all. You love to see it. Nah, he's safe. But Maryland's still on the can count. They got to get rid of the ball. That will, oh, he dropped it. Man, Wallace, what are you, Wilson, what are you doing, my guy? Yeah, it's, just, it's up to Dixon, but he's making it interesting. And that's it. Kyle Strong with the catch. 1-0 lead in favor of Towson. Highly unlikely this game will count as it is currently... 310. We got 20 minutes left. So 830 in the first. Yikes. Yeah, we ain't got enough time.
Good throw by Connor. Yeah, my apologies for the score, y'all. The score is 1-0 in favor of Towson. It's now 4-0 in favor of Maryland. I've got the change from the last game. My apologies. I think that was a team catch. But 92 is out. Good throw by Nate. Good reset throw. And it will get the ball back. Not a good pump fake. Not a good pump fake. Nope, nothing. Clip him. Ooh, but pull with the catch. So what happened? The catch counts. 20 is still out though, unfortunately. Yep. Oh, good kill by Connor. Taking out Eric on that exchange. Yeah. Did that clip them? It did clip them. Good kill by Adam. Taking out number 27. Uh, 27. 27, Justin. All right, Connor's pushing up, still pushing up. Almost went, almost got the foot. Long throw, no dice. No dice by either team. Good block. That was a good block, that was a good block. Nah, not a good block. Yeah, both teams been doing well blocking. Oh, he was lazy. Dane Nevin Garrett. And he's having a good time. Hey, yeah, good block. Oh, too many. And he dropped it. Dane 21. That's kind of a tough break. Tough, tough break for my man, Wilson. The toe tap, no, well, not even a toe tap. That hit my man off the knees, and yeah, I know. Sometimes you just gotta shake your head, huh, Adam? Sometimes you just gotta shake your. Actually, no. My apologies, Zach. My apologies, Zach. Sometimes you just gotta shake your head. we got here. Nate with a throw. Reset throw successful. Well, he will not get the ball back. Good pump fake by number 22. Kyle Schroen with another reset throw. He will get this ball back. All right. Good attempt. No dice. All right, Adam with the reset. All right, not a reset throw. This time by Chris. It's kind of just been reset for both teams. Yeah, this pretty much been a lot of misses by 
by uh, Towson as of late. They're definitely getting their reset reps in. But uh, three minutes left for the first, and I uh, just don't think we have enough time. Do not pay attention to the uh, to the game clock. It's it's under three minutes. Just don't pay attention. It's just it's whatever. Um, this game won't even count um, if we can't get 40 minutes in. Um, by 3.30 and it just doesn't it doesn't look like that's going to happen 20 minutes is the is the is the lowest time you can do per half um, and, and, and 40 minutes is required in order for it to count as a game so Got him by the foot. Oh, team catch. Great job by Caleb. Team catch is successful. That will bring in number 20, Christian, into the match. Ah, uh, he could not successfully block it. Number 31, Adam Rodriguez goes down in that exchange. Maryland kind of drew too many on that one. Kyle Strong doing what he does best, just being a great overall player. I know that on um, Corner Sporo, oh, that was a great kill by. Um, by Hines. Take it out number nine, Adam. I remember um, Connor, I remember Connor saying that um, Kyle Strong just, has just been consistently just been Towson, God, Jesus, two kills and a headshot. And of course we had an angle, so of course that happened and we got it. Um, but as I was saying, um, Connor Sport have said that Kyle Strong consistently has been the best player for Towson as he takes out pool. And he's not even like, he's just been consistent. God, Jesus! Woo! Nate goes down that and chains Lord have mercy, Jesus. Oh, drop catch. Not enough time. They couldn't get the point in time, but nevertheless, some great, great highlight reels and great job. But number 25, Ryan, for just surviving. The point almost counted. But man, it just said set it up, no halftime. Just get it going. So we'll just go ahead and put the 20-minute boy for the second half real quick. And like I said, if they don't kick us out, this game will count. If they do kick us out, <laughs> well, it's been fun. It's been fun, y'all. It's been fun. I really had a great time with everybody. Everybody gets set. Everybody gets set. Crazy enough, I think the score is still one to zero. Hey Zach, is the score still one to zero? That's absolutely crazy. Now here's the kicker though. I don't know if they're gonna allow us to play overtime. Highly unlikely. Uh, but yeah, this is only a one to zero game. And Connor goes down that exchange. Great kill by number 34, Nate, to get the kill. Go ahead and just turn it up a little bit. There we go. Oh, and that's why I don't do that. Turn it down. 
Hey, no cursing on the stream, y'all. Stop doing that. Don't do that. Woo! Another headshot. Sheesh! Another headshot. This time, the victim is number 24, Franklin. Sheesh! So unfortunate. Nah. Yes, that is a catch. That is a catch. Great job by Eric getting the catch. Picking out Chris from that exchange. Adam could not secure the catch. He goes down. All right, ball's over. The clock is still running. The clock is still running. Unsuccessful. Team throw still. Actually, this time team throw is successful. Number 20, Christian goes out of chain. Four players left. Dixon to our far right. Nate in the middle, who just got out. Pool in the middle. And then number 25, Ryan. Actually, now there's two players left because apparently we missed off camera of how Dixon got out. Woo! Team throw successful. One play left to beat. It was Ryan. Still alive. Suicide throw! Ah! Failure. Temp. Apparently it worked. Even though he didn't hit him, it still counts. How does that make sense? Make it make sense. It still works though. Okay, now we suit his ear. Sheesh. Will they finish this game? They will not. As it is currently 325 in the afternoon. <laughs> and the gym was very particular about saying that this game, this gym, they will have to stop playing at 330. So the likelihood that we're going to call this a real game will not happen. But we will have some great highlights though, nevertheless. Great catch though by number 52, take it out. Number 11, Nathan.
Apparently, I don't have number 52 name on here because I don't see his number on here. Hate to see it. Eh, a little staggered. Double, single throw. Well, make that triple now. As Nate Poe. Actually, no, that's not Nate. My apologies. I'm sorry. Chris, Poe, and Connor all goes out of that exchange. Garrett goes out. And that last exchange. Let's see what Kyle Strong's going to do. Ooh, that was kind of too high for Eric. It will count it. They will counter though. Nate with another kill. That's probably balls over, and that's the worst time to have a balls over. Clock is still running, but yeesh. Here he comes. Mm. Yep, 99 is going down. And Rodriguez is safe. But yeah, 99 goes down that exchange for Maryland. Woo! God! Nate just caught that. And Adam definitely drew that ball with bad intentions, too. And just like that, Maryland is on a 10 count. <laughs> Nate just absolutely just snagged the crap out of that ball, dude. <laughs> Yo. Straight up. My oh, man didn't even care. This game may not even count, but he's still playing like it counts. That's why you got to love him, man. That's why he's one of the captains for Towson. Tommy back on Demon's time, taking out Rodriguez. Oh, Kyle with the missed catch. Kind of unconventional for him. Team catch, successful. Not a pump fake. More pump fakes. Missed throw. Well, actually not missed throw. It's just that, yeah, it wasn't even a missed throw. It's just that 25. 25 Ryan was just shifty. But no, that was actually a good throw by Gary. It was on point. Woo! Change up. Oh. Ah oh, ha ha. And 52 goes down from Towson. Three players left for Maryland. Oh yeah, oh yeah, Dixon will force the issue. Pretty sure it's 3:30. If it's not 3:30, it's 3:29. Ah, uh, drop catch by Eric. Yep. Three plays left for Maryland. Team throw. Nope. Whew. Nate taking out number 25, Ryan. Nate's just eating now, man. He's just eating. Last play is left. Caleb Dixon. 
Well, that was easy. Wilson goes down by the change. You can't throw. You can't throw at Caleb like that, man. Like that's just not the way to go. Got to put at least three on him. Got at least three. Oh yes, and Nate successfully taking out the other Nate. Now pulls in again. That ball kind of just sailed. Interesting. Yeah, she wants to go home. Sheesh. I don't know about y'all, but I'm going to see if I can try to start packing up. I think this is going to be the last point. It's actually past 3.30 now. Oh, please. You got to catch that. Yikes. Wow. Sheesh. Drop catch. Kyle Strong with the kill. Nate with the catch. Taking out number taking out number 22. Cars down in the game. Sheesh. Ah, he reach, he reach, he reach, he reach, he reach. Cars in. Dixon's in. Sheesh. We're still going, y'all. And Carter goes down with the lethal changeup. I, I think he might be gassed out. Eh, fair enough. Yep, one play left to beat. Once again, Caleb Dixon. Team throw coming up. That got him. That should do it. That should do it. I'm pretty sure that a 3-0 victory should be convincing enough. Should be able to be done. Just not enough time. That's it. All right, y'all. It's been fun. It's been fun. I'm heading home. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much about it, y'all. Until next time. Girl, don't be complacent. You better take time.